Looks like we're safe for now. We were lucky to get out of there, you know? But we didn't all make it out. Poor Eric, he... Oh, I can't imagine what they'll do to him. Oh, don't worry, sweetie. Eric's tougher than he looks. I think. That Jasper was talking some nonsense, though, huh? I mean, why call the one who's trying to beat the Dark One the Dark Spawn? Honey, that's just confusing. He isn't really the Dark Spawn. That's just what the King of Heliodor thinks. It's all some terrible misunderstanding. I'm ever so sorry, Silvando. We should have explained all this to you earlier, but, well, so much has been going on. Oh, please, there's no need to apologize, darling. Darkspawn, indeed. As if a lovely little thing like you would go around with someone like that. Oh, Silvando. Now, are we gonna stand around here all night, or are we gonna take action, huh? Let's sneak up to that bridge in the middle of town and see if we can spot where they're keeping Eric. Be quiet as mice now, and use the buildings for cover. The streets are crawling with soldiers. In fact, let's see if we can get up onto the rooftops through the inn. That might be the best route to the bridge.
I know you are scurrying around in the shadows like the rodent you are, Darkspawn. Show yourself! Or you can stay hidden and see what happens to your friend. Something tells me he's not the patient type. We'd better get to Eric before things turn nasty. Ah, there's a gondola stop off to the northwest near the contest stage. We could sneak up close to them from there. Let's hop on a gondola and glide on over. Mustn't keep dear Eric waiting. from stage right and save the day. <laughs> so finally you scurry into the light. You rats think to gain the advantage by ambushing me while I am unguarded. I welcome the chance to tear you apart with my own hands, Darkspawn.
darlings, Sylph's here. Silvanda grows even greater. Oh, goody. <sighs> Brought to my knees, fight. You vermin. Ugh, how could this happen? <clears throat> <gasps> Oh, Eric, are you all right? Here, let me untie you. <clears throat> what devilry is this, Darkspawn? By what trickery did you manage to overcome Sir Jasper? <clears throat> <clears throat> It matters not. You have had your fun. Now accept your fate and give yourselves up. <laughs> Alright, this is gonna seem crazy, but just trust me, okay? Geronimo! <laughs> <laughs> True to form, the rats leap from the sinking ship. So much for your faithful friends, Darkspawn. Now, this ridiculous farce has gone on long enough. All that remains is for you to choose how it ends. Surrender to me, or entrust your fate to the sharks that circle beneath. Well? Which will it be? Oh! Sir Jasper! Look! Hmm? Ah.
Yoo-hoo! How's that for a dramatic entrance, huh? Introducing the Salty Stallion, the finest ship to ever sashay across the seas. <laughs> Dame, be a darling and pull over to the quayside so my friends can hop on, will you? Right you are, Silva. All aboard! <laughs> <laughs> Ciao for now, Jasper, darling. Bet you didn't see that ending coming. Ooh, I do love a twist. What are your orders, sir? They're getting away. They will not get far. It. And by the skin of our teeth, we owe you one, Sylv. Oh, don't be silly, darling. Dave is the one you need to thank. It's his steady hand on the helm that steered us out of the jaws of danger. <laughs> oh, stop it, Sylv. I'm just doing my job. No need to... Blimey, what the heck's that? <laughs> oh my goodness! It's disgusting! <laughs> I told you you would not get far. Enjoy your journey to the ocean floor. Now, my dear Tentacula, welcome your new friends to the loving embrace of the deep. Crikey, here he comes! Oh, I'm too young and beautiful to die! What's that noise? Those are Gondolian merchant ships. What are they? Fire! That monster always is harassing the ships in this area. Molto irritante. <laughs> hey, it's me, Placido. Listen, I can speak now. I have back my voice again. The boy, he tell me everything. He tell me it's you who cure him. And also, he convinced me that you are no dark spawn. That is no you who curse him in this way. He explained everything to me. Scusa, Amici. I have done to you a great disservice. Some days ago, I play outside the town, and I observe Sir Jasper talking to the monster. He's scary, so I make a little scream. He hears me, and curse my voice so I cannot speak about what I see. It was horrible. Oh, I learned that the one they call the Darkspawn save my boy, and the noble knights of Eliodor, they consort with the monsters. What does it all mean? I cannot understand. 
But I know that you are an hero. And an hero must escape to fight another day, see? Dark Spawn! <gasps> Hear me! Today, you were lucky. But your luck will run out. And when it does, I will be there. If you are wise, you will live in fear of that day. Things won't be easy for you now. You defied the Heliodorians, and they don't like that. Don't let them grind you down, you hear? We live to see another sunrise. We're blessed. Blessed, I tell you. Oh, Dave, I forgot to ask. Have you heard any little birdies chirping about a merchant buying something called the Rainbow over in Galopolis? Oh, have as it happened, Silver. Word on the grapevine is the fellow what bought it headed over Zvardrust way. This really isn't just a game to you, huh? <laughs> Friends, shipmates, amigos, Svarts Rust and the Rainbow await. Onward, forward, northeastward, the Stani beckons. <laughs> 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 <laughs>